تنهل من روبا الخير If you have distaste for religion, the Quran or Islam, please erase this from your mind and focus solely on the Quran's scientific message. The Quran appeared in the 7th century, a period in human history when there was widespread ignorance and scientific knowledge was almost non-existent. The book makes such powerful statements about the universe and life that the reader is driven to invoke an all-knowing mind to explain such data. But before we begin examining the Quran, let me emphasize two points. One, the Quran does not make vague statements like the prophecies of Nostradamus, which can be interpreted depending on the weather. The book expresses in precise scientific language its superior knowledge of the cosmos. It takes you on a journey of discovery from the beginning of time through the various stages of cosmic evolution until the end of time. Two, if you have heard verses of the Quran and are unimpressed or expect a repetition of ideas, please be assured. Dr. Noor's in-depth research of the Quran provides new revealing insights of the inner workings of the universe which are unheard of in works of a similar nature. I am referring to ultra-modern scientific concepts, many of which have only been uncovered in the last few decades. Let me give you a few examples. The Quran, a 7th century document, describes the singularity, cosmic expansion, the nature of space, Einstein's concept of gravity, references to atoms, cells, DNA, extraterrestrial existence, embryology, and many more concepts which were entirely unheard of at the time. The pattern followed throughout Dr. Neuer's book is to give you, the reader, a brief background of the subject under discussion so that you get the basic idea and then follow it up with relevant Quranic passages, followed by a brief commentary.